Do you feel restricted by gender stereotyping? Not really feeling comfortable with society's rules and norms, and perhaps even want to revolt? Then meet your predecessor, Leonor Fini. Leonor is a truly fascinating woman and stands as one of the best example of the rejection of any social conventions and rules. She's been an inspiration to Madonna, Andrew Warhol, French fashion designers such as Dior and Jean-Paul Gaultier. Leonor is known as a surrealist painter, designer, illustrator and author, known for her depictions of powerful women. Leonor's contribution to the empowerment of women and to art history is huge, although her presence has been somehow marginalised and forgotten for quite a long time. What made Leonor stand out from her male surrealist contemporaries was that Leonor made artistic history by painting the first ever erotic new portrait of a man made by a woman. She continued to depict males in an unconventional manner, soft, androgynous, powerless and beautiful. She explained, The man in my painting sleeps because he refuses the animal's role of the social and constructed and has rejected the responsibility of working in society towards those end, Leonor said in an interview. Leonor did not like to be labelled. She was simply Leonor who performed certain activities at certain times, such as being a painter. Leonor was part of the pre-war generation of Parisian artists and very important in the Surrealist movement. But Leonor is far more overlooked and forgotten than the male Surrealist painters such as Salvador Dali and Picasso. Salvador Dali said about Leonor that Leonor was better than most perhaps, but talent is in their balls. Did uh, Leonor care about Salvador Dali's opinion? Nah, not really. In fact, Leonor was somewhat of a recluse. A friend of her said that Leonor was in no need of outside stimulation. She was an audience of her own being, but when she did go out, she loved to make brief, shocking appearances at formal events, dressed in elaborate costumes of her own design. I have always loved and lived my own theatre, Leonor once said. Leonor lived her life truly unapologetically and she is a huge inspiration to many. For example, Madonna used Leonor's painting The Ends of the World as inspiration for her music video Bedtime Story. In 1936, Leonor designed the bottle for the perfume called Shocking and you can clearly see that Jean-Paul Gaultier's torso-shaped perfume bottles have been inspired by Leonor. And Leonor was tributed the Fashion House Dior's 2018 Spring Collection. The Dior designer said that Leonor was a feminist hero, fearless and very modern. She built herself like a piece of art in a time all the big artists were men. For us, Leonor is truly an intoxicated woman and artist, dynamic and a creative fire. What are your thoughts of Leonor? Let us know in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any updates.